How do? This is my uh, first game on Planetary Annihilation. Uh, it's also my first solo let's play on my uh, channel, so let's see how it goes. Um, to begin with, we're going to get some metal extractors down, some energy plants. Uh, for some reason, it spawned us on the moon by the looks of it. Um, we played, well, I've played three other games. Uh, got midway through and they, they crashed so yeah I mean it's still very early alpha so I suppose that's to be expected um, so yeah let's get on with it once I've got these uh, plants down I think I'll get um, Vehicle factory down, uh, so I can start getting. I'll get a couple more fabrication units to build up, help me build up some st some structures. Um, get an air factory down as well, so I can uh, get a scout out. Looks like I mean this moon seems a lot smaller than the planets on the other ones, uh, on the other games I played. So I've got a feeling that. I may be quite close to some enemy units. Got vehicle factory there. Um, and then the other, no, actually, no, I'll do an air factory next to that. Um, yeah, I'll do an air factory. What should I do? I don't know, because... Yeah, I need, I need to get an air factory down. Then I can get a scout out and see whereabouts... Uh, the enemy units are. Um, in fact, I may as well get another vehicle factory as well so I can later on start spamming tanks out. Just in case they are quite close. Get a metal storage and a energy storage down here. Just to increase uh, how many resources I can keep. Get some more power plants down. Get a couple of fabrication units out. Bit more there. I guess the key to this game is keeping your resources up and not getting supply blocks. Um, the other games have not really done so well at that. Normally, end up getting rushed or something, so I, I panic and start building a ton of troops. I try only want one of them scout planes. This radar should reveal any units that are really close. So that's it. Okay, so we're pretty good for now. Okay, to start building the advanced vehicle factory so I can get some level 2 tanks out, or advanced tanks and. Uh, artillery tanks as well. The artillery tanks are, are really useful. They're, they're, they're a lot like the siege tanks in... Um, oh, there's, there's one of the players. Will he follow that patrol route? I don't think he will. I think I'll have to click him off. He's too busy attacking them. I'll just fly him around here manually and have a quick scout around. Ah, there's the orange player. Great, so I'm in between two. I don't know where the white player is. He possibly could be around on the other side. Just know is that the moon's orbs in the moon. <laughs> oh. Hey, back off. Get some air uh, defences down. Let's get a couple down here as well. The uh, last game I played, I managed to get three rows of these turrets just circling my base, and that, that did a really good job of holding off a lot of units while I got to build up an army in the middle. Um, got my army ready, and then just as I was about to send out, it uh, crashed. So, <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so the artillery tanks are a lot like the siege tanks in StarCraft 2, uh, where if you, if you have a nice wall of them, they do really well. Um, and they're taking out structures and armies coming towards you. Um, so they, they seem quite handy. Get 
this bomber built up as well here, so... Was that my scout that went down? Yeah, it must have been. Move some tanks down here. Oh. Can I shoot that down? No. Oh. They're trying. Let's see if uh, my commander can. Oh, he's landing. Hoorah! Okay, let's uh, send these four tanks out and see if we can do a bit of damage. I'm going to attack from this side. I've got some turrets building up at the top side, so that should be okay. Pull him down to finish working on the, ad uh, on the advanced factory. Oh, bomber. Okay, I'll send these free tanks out, we'll see if we can do a bit of damage. Oh, wow. Looks like he's going quite heavy air. Get a few more of these done. These uh, anti-air turrets are they're quite useful. I mean, they will attack ground units as well. I don't know if that's how the men are work or. Has he got anything there? Oh, he's got some anti air vehicles. Oh, man. Send this bomber over here and see if we can do a bit of damage. I'll try and get his tanks. Oh, he's building an artillery. Ah, oh, got took down before I could take it out. The artillery gun he's building is quite good. I mean, the, the level 2 or the advanced artillery gun has got really long range. Um, about half of the. Uh, I don't know. It, with this moon, uh, it'll probably cover half the moon. Uh, the level 1 artillery cannons, though, are still good. Really good. Oh, that's it firing over there. That's not good. Need to get that other bomber finished. See if we can get these tanks round to take that artillery cannon out because otherwise he's going to be able to. If he gets a radar up, he should be able to hit all my power plants and stuff there. I shouldn't have really clustered him, probably. Yeah, there's two more tanks. Where's my. There. Go on, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yes. Lost the bomber, but I got that out. That's, that's one issue dealt with. Get a couple of uh, fabrication air units. Guys up here, I need you. Uh, should move you up there. Get a couple more. And yeah, throw it down. Luckily enough, the player on the right of me, the blue player, he doesn't seem to be attacking at the moment. Um, whether that means he's building up his army or if he's just getting some defences down. Either way, um, my main worry is this orange player at the moment. He seems to be the one sending the attacks constantly, so if I can get this artillery cannon here, I should be able to take out anything he has. Oh, did I just lose something? Another artillery gun going down. Oh wow, he's got quite a lot of units there. Why is it not? Oh, it won't let me select my units again then. Could be possibly when I'm selecting. If if the selection box go of, goes over the UI um, and then you release the mouse button, it's just not detecting that. I did have it earlier where I um, had a scout point. I went to put it on patrol and then the UI froze. Um, so it wouldn't let. Oh, he's taking out my thing. I'll boom. Put this one a bit further back. Uh, the UI froze, so I couldn't build any units. None of the build menus would show up. Um, so I just I had to send everything I had out to. Um, well, I didn't have to, but I decided to. There's nothing else I could do really. Um, the game ended up crashing mid battle anyway, so <laughs> never mind, eh? To 
get a bit of a defensive wall here. Get a couple of bombers. If I can, what what they've done in this this version of the Alpha, I think they've changed it. So if you can take out their commander, it will destroy all their bases and uh, units. Whereas in earlier Alphas, um, you had to destroy all the units, the commander and the bases to uh, win. I think. Uh, whereas now you only have to kill the commander. So if I can get a couple of bombers in there and hopefully take out his commander, that'll stop him uh, harassing me. I really need to get more efficient with my economy. I'm supply blocking myself. When that's done, actually, I'll get him to. Should I do it now? Yeah. I'll wait until he's done that and then I'll get him to build his power plants. Down you go. Oh, tank. Is that going in there? Uh, one thing I have noticed you can uh, set waypoints for the buildings, there's just no indication of it at the moment, uh, no visual indications. Um, so you just select the building and uh, right click on the ground where you want it to, where you want the units to go. Um, oh great. You can also group up units uh, by pressing, holding control and pressing a number. So like my tanks are, are set to control one. Um, again there's no indication yet but I mean it works so it's always worth knowing that. Let's see if I can get this bomber to do any splash damage. Oh, he's got the same idea that looks a bit. Wow, yeah that did nothing. Open fire Yeah this is not looking good. Oh, he's on that supply block now on energy. <laughs> Let's get. Ah, this is finished. A couple of weeks being built. Artillery shooting in as well. Get him over here. I need to um, get my commander down here, building some more metal extractors. Hopefully his army won't come that far into my base, so I should. I just need to make sure I protect my uh, commander at all costs. Because at least then if I can get away with him, I can, I can rebuild and... Man. Give me a break. I'm a noob. Yes. <laughs> um, okay, he's pulling away. Okay, so I need to get my uh, economy back up as fast as possible, really. Cancel that. Come on. That bomb is nearly done. I don't really want to cancel it. Orange guy. Nice. The orange guy is out of the game. Although, does that mean the white guy is now? I'll send this over here and have a look. If the white player is on his way over here, I'm screwed. Oh, wow. Yeah, you come back here. Let's go have a look at the blue play. What's that? Oh, oh shit. 
Yeah. Um. that up I need to get some units out I need to get my economy back up and get some units out I, sh I went I went advanced I went tech 2 too early or advanced knew it should have kept with the basics hopefully though if I, no one bothers me should be able to get back in this oh what oh shit run Run away! That guy's got a load of Tech 2 tanks. Oh, advanced. Man. Go, go, go. Quickly. Run away! Oh no. Keep going, keep going. If I try and draw him. Oh, no, never mind, he's pulling away. I was gonna walk into the blue base. Oh, wait. Run! Right, um, let's start. Let's start again. <laughs> Get them going. I need you to build a vehicle factory so we can start getting tanks out. I do like the, uh, the whole concept of it all being on worlds. Like I say, it takes a while getting used to the. Con Where are you going? Okay, just help on that. Um, takes a while getting used to. Um, especially when you're reliant on a mini map, or when you use a mini map as 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 much as uh, you tend to do in most strategy games. If I can get my economy back up. Hopefully you won't know I'm up here. Or hopefully you'll run into that blue base. I don't know why I should build that yet. I'll get some level one vehicle factory down. I think this is the, the problem I had down at my original spawn. I, I weren't getting the the economy, was just I was really poor at managing it. Um, so I'm just going to try and spam it as much as I can now. Keep it up. Because if you're not supply blocked, your units will build faster. Defences, buildings, so it's definitely worth getting as much as you can down. I don't know if there is any weapons that cause splash damage. Um, should I build, yeah, build that there? The blue player is directly below me. Um, so I've got some basic defences up here. In fact, you know what? I'm going to join it up. Up here. And then I really need to. Um, Start getting a bit of. Oh, I'm going to go. I'll get an artillery actually here as well. Ah no, I'll get radar. radar. Um, at some point I need to try and fi figure out where the white player is. He he had a ton of um, advanced tanks. Um, from what I could see from the blue player, I didn't see many much of an army, but. There's nothing on the radar, so let's get this artillery down here. I don't know if that artillery can turn or not. I guess so, because the, the radius for it... Uh, I don't know. We'll find out, we'll find out. The uh, blue player did look like he found some sort of glitch. I'm sh I'm sh I don't know if it was just my screen glitching out or the way he's built his defence towers, but it looked like he had a... Um, you know, like a ton of rocket towers all in all in the same spot. So after he's done that, I need him to uh, get another vehicle factory down so I can spam more units out quicker. My energy income's looking better now. Hmm. Well, 
it's in the plus anyway. Get this uh, advanced factory up here. Not really much I can do while. What was that? Oh, is that being built? Oh man, I thought I was being attacked again. Oh, my other metal structures survived. Just at the. Uh, Rally point for that factory there. And I'll put this one here. That artillery cannon is nearly done now. I guess the only problem with building the artillery without having much defences down is if it does start attacking and then that guy figures out, or oh, obviously he's going to know that it's coming from just up from him. What was that? Oh, he's got artillery as well by the looks of it. So I need to get some more metal extractors down. You, sir. Ah, oh, okay, my artillery's not in range or anything. This bot factory, uh, I've not really used many of the bots, uh, I've seen one guy who had a, a huge army of bots and just absolutely spammed them out um, and did a lot of damage, but whether or not they'll fare up to them advanced tanks, we'll, we'll find out. going. wonder where... We really need to get an air base down in a minute. Yeah, they've taken all my other metal structures out, so... Advanced air factory there. Try to get some uh, advanced bombers out. Surprised, uh, surprised I've not been tacked yet, actually. It's quite lucky to get away then. Oh, what? <laughs> I don't know what my commander's doing.
that. I like how the planet isn't perfectly round as well. It's good. It is deformed and, you know, it would have been easy for him to just put in a sphere. Let's get a, another advanced unit there. Because once that's done, I'll be able to get some bigger artillery cannons down and an advanced radar, which should give me a better idea of where everyone is. Should reach into the blue player's base with, without any problems. What's he doing? Oh. Shift. Let him pass. There we go. Shift him here so they're not in the way. Thing is, it always worries me when um, oh, my first advanced tank. Yeah, it always it always worries me when. Um, I mean, I've moved up and I've started rebuilding. I'm getting quite quite a nice little army going now, but it makes me think, what what's what have they got? You know, they've not had to uh, rebuild and waste the time doing all this, so. down I can start. I'll shift these here as well. Ah, bomber. 